Hello everyone, Christine McKee here from the Emerging Technology team. Today we're going to take a closer look at the new presenter mode in Microsoft Teams meetings. So I'm going to go ahead and join this Teams meeting. All right, now to access the new presenter mode, I'm simply going to come up to the share content icon here in the top menu bar. When I click it, the panel is going to open along the right, allowing me to decide how I'm going to share my content and what content I'm going to share. Now notice below the title share content is presenter mode. Notice that we have four options or four styles for how we can present and share our content with our audience. The first option is content only. With content only, you are just seeing slides presented in that traditional slides format. But notice that we have three other very immersive perspectives, including the first standout. Let's take a look at what Standout looks like. Standout is possibly the most immersive perspective for presenter mode. Notice that the presenter, in this case myself, is placed right inside the content, right inside the slides. All right, our second perspective for presenter mode is side by side. Let's take a closer look at what side by side looks like. As you can see with side by side, the presenter is placed in a video window to the right of the content that they are sharing. This way, the audience has a clear view of the content, but also has a clear view of the presenter. And our third option, or our fourth option, I should say, is reporter. Let's take a closer look at what the reporter layout looks like. All right, as you can see, the reporter layout features the presenter along the bottom right corner of the screen while featuring the content slightly adjacent to the left. The presenter is featured larger and the content is reduced in size. Now, keep in mind for side-by-side -side view and reporter presenter mode, you will see a background. You can change this background by clicking Add Background. And notice that you have a variety of backgrounds to choose from inside of Microsoft Teams. Let's go back. All right, so once you've selected your presenter mode, you would then simply select what content you wish to share, your entire screen, a window, and so on. Note that you can always change the presenter mode while you're presenting. Simply move your mouse up to the very top of the window or your monitor, and you will see the presenter mode options appear. All right, now last thing I'm gonna remind you of is before you share your content, don't forget if you need to include your computer sound to toggle that switch on. Once you've toggled that on, then go ahead and select the content you wish to share with your audience. If you have any questions about presenter mode or any of the new features in Microsoft Teams meetings, please feel free to reach out to the MTech team.